Welcome to my channel, or oh, welcome back. I am tickle pink that you're here today because today I have for you some goodies. I don't usually do hauls because here in the area that I live in, we don't have a lot of good stuff. Like we don't have a lot of, I don't never catch the sales when everybody else does. Um, our Dollar Trees are non-existent. I, I mean, we have Dollar Trees, but they have like nothing in them that some of these other crafters find, and I'm so jealous. Um, but today I did get some good stuff. Uh, I went to the Hobby Lobby, and I came across day one of their spring clearance sale. And today they had just put the stuff on the shelves at 75% off. And I just happened to be there. What are the odds? I was just going in to get some wood pile stuff, which is their, their little section called wood pile that I like. And I slung up in there and I was like, what's up, guys? And they were like, you see all these orange tags? And I says, yeah, well, you know, what's up? And they were like, that's 75% off. And I was like, my husband's going to hate me when I get finished. But we won't talk about him right now. Let's just talk about some of the goodies I got, okay? Let's start off with, um, let's start off with the Dollar Tree because it's probably the least amount of things because like I said, we don't get that much. So, I know everybody's already seen these. These are the little stickers with the cactuses. It's the rub on stickers. Whoopie doo. I think everybody saw those. Um, I love these, and I haven't been to the Dollar Tree in a couple of weeks, so I haven't seen if we, even if we did, just happen to get stuff in, which we won't, but, you know, just in case. I think these are so cute, guys. It's their scarf, and they have, it's sticking to my finger, has turtles on it. How cute, it's a little turtle, and he's going to swim, and he's so cute. Anyways, um... Okay, let's see. What else did I get? Okay. I know you guys have probably already seen all these, and I'll go through it really quick. This is just the USA finger thing. Star stickers. Seen it before. All right. Okay. I'm going to try to make it real quick, I promise. I'm going to be doing a coastal uh, theme really soon, or like beachy theme. And this is like little lip gloss. But I thought it was cute because after my daughter uses the lip gloss up, I can use this in a DIY double win. All right. Oh, I was excited about this. My husband is an electrician and I know about Milwaukee everything. Okay. So these are those blades that go in our... I have about cut myself. These are the blades that go in our long, like our craft knives. You know what I'm talking about? Our craft knives. Um, these are the blades that go in there, and there are ten in a thing. And I didn't even, I didn't even know for sure what was in there. I just got it because it said Milwaukee on it, and I was like, "What? They got Milwaukee in the Dollar Tree? Are you kidding me?" And so I was super excited about that. Can't get the top on. Let's move on. All right. Um, de -de 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 -de. And then I found some die cut butterflies. Okay, like I said, you guys have probably seen all this stuff before. Okay, so I'm going fast on those. All right. What else did we get from the DT? Okay, DT. This is my very last two or three things. Um, I do like these pails that the DT got in. The Dollar Tree, in case you don't know what DT means. No, it doesn't mean like when you're having alcoholic withdrawals, although you do call that DTs also. I'm a nurse and I always want to teach people stuff and I need to stop doing that because most of you people probably know what the, even what DT means and it's like it's just in me to want to teach. Anyways, hang with me guys. I promise I'm not usually like this. I am, okay? Let's just face it. So, whatever. Okay, the inside of these kind of look like a little solo cup. Like, I don't drink. I even though I act like it, but I don't. By the way, we're in my bedroom. Yay, we're in my bedroom. And 
Um, we've never filmed in here before, but my craft room is getting built and it's almost done. Like in another few days, I will be moving my stuff in there. And my original craft room that I use now is a hot mess. And like, I couldn't even probably walk in there and just stand and be like, here's this, here's this, because it's that messy. And I do like these from the Dollar Tree. It's those little cupcake type stands that they've gotten in not, not, not too long ago. Maybe in the last month I've been seeing these. I really like these. They're so cute. Okay. So that's all from the Dollar Tree. So let's go to Family Dollar because in case you guys did not know, Family Dollar and Dollar Tree are married. Did y'all know that? I had no idea. And the family dollar that I shop at, I was like, I came across some of the little, um, the little bins, you know, these things, the little cr crates, whatever we call them, you know. I came across these at my family dollar and I told the lady, they sell these at Dollar Tree and it even says Greenbrier on the back, so what's up? And she told me that they are the same company. They're like, they're sister companies, but yet, I mean, the same people own them, you know? So, needless to say, my point is, and I do have one, that you can get some of the same stuff at the Dollar Tree, I'm sorry, at the Family Dollar. If you can't find it at the Dollar Tree, try your Family Dollar. You may look up and find some of the stuff. Like, my Dollar Tree never has these anymore. Never, okay, never. I don't know why, but the Family Dollar always has them. Just letting you know. And I came across this, and I was, this is so cute. It was a buck. It reminds me of, and I'll have to turn the thing out. It's, it's, a, light, it's a light bulb that goes outside. It's an outdoor hanging light bulb. Okay, so when you turn it on, and it's solar, this part's plastic, but, I mean, it's a buck, you know. Um, it's a dollar. And it reminds me of the ones that they had um, back at Christmas time that a lot of the crafters were getting from the Dollar Tree. Of course, we didn't get them. Okay. Like I said, we get nothing. Nothing. So, I got three of those. And I got this. And I thought this was cute. It, this was a buck. It's a little butterfly. I don't know if you can see it or not. You probably can. It's a fiber optic butterfly made by the same company. It's got a little sucky thing on the bottom. A little, you know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. Those little things where it sticks and everything. And it's a little butterfly and it's going to fly away. That's how I talk to my pug, y'all. I don't know why I am talking to y'all that way. It's been a long day. I have shopped. I'm excited. Okay, let's move on to... Oh, wait, wait. One more thing. I am way excited about this, y'all. Okay, not this. This is a bird. Uh, a lot of my uh, subscribers have asked me because I paint my birds white. And I've been telling you guys, go to the Dollar General. And they're, they're these small little birds. That's a dollar. Well, they also have these. These were a buck at Family Dollar, and it's this fat bird. And I mean, look how cute. I mean, it's fat, and it's cute, and it kind of reminded me of me because it's like all fat and plump and just sitting there waiting on to, time to eat. And I don't know. I thought it was cute. Anywho, this is what I really got excited about at Family Dollar. I know y'all are probably like, it's a canvas, Dumbo. Okay, but hold on. It is a stretched 11 by 17. And if you are a Dollar Tree shopper, you know that the only stretched canvas that you will ever find at the Dollar Tree is an 8 by 10. That's the biggest they go. Now, the other day, I was watching a haul with Jamie, the crafty DIY guy. And he went to one of those new Dollar Trees that's a Dollar Tree slash Super Dollar Tree. And so they have some items that are, it's still Dollar Tree, but they have a few rows that are like $3 items and $5 items. They had 11 by 14 canvases for three bucks because I was like, oh, good. That way we can move up a size. But guys, this was a dollar. It was a dollar. 
and it's an 11 by 17. And so when I skirted up to the register, this is just a quick little story. I know y'all don't want to hear it, but I'm going to tell it anyway. I went up to the register and I was like, I don't know the price on this. So if you'll just let me know. And I'm thinking in my head, it's three bucks and I'm going to get it. So she rang it up and she's like, it's a dollar. And I was like, it's a dollar. And she's like, yes, it's a dollar. And I go, it's a dollar. And she's like, it's a dollar. And I was like, well, hold on a minute. Let me go get the other one. So there was a few more back there. Nobody shops at our family dollar, and I've never seen these there before, so they had just put them on the shelf. So I went and got the others that were there, and I paid a buck a piece for these. So, hey, y'all, y'all may not think this is a big deal, but if you're a crafter, this is a big deal. We do, I do a lot of where I pull the canvas off, and I put it on the back of the picture, and I make something beautiful. And I can do that with these because they're bigger. Like, I mean, it, you know, I'm really excited about that. It's the small things in life that make you happy. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six of them. All right, now let's get into the Hobby Lobby stuff. Okay, this is not going to be a long haul. I told y'all it wasn't, and I'm sitting here, you know, I'm sorry. All right. The first thing that I got from Hobby Lobby is one of their 75% uh, off, and it's a candle. It's a big candle, and it is Chesapeake Bay Candle Pineapple Verbena, and it was $4.24, and it's a three-wick, baby. Uh, uh, uh. It's a three-wick. It's not a one-wick. It's three-wick. Like it matters. Maybe it does. Let me know in the comments if it matters. I don't know. I'll burn a one wick. I'll burn a three wick. Heck, I'd burn it if it didn't have a wick. I'd just cut it up, put it in my wax warmer. Anyway, I know you people haven't watched me before. It's probably like, what is she on? I'm on nothing but the Holy Spirit. I promise you. I love the Lord. I promise you that, okay? If I'm high on anything, it's the Lord, okay? And super duper happy because I actually found a sale. I never find them, guys. Okay, now I got these. I've been looking for some cutesy tootsy little vases, like little vases, you know, and I got three of these. These were their, on their 50, per, you know how they'll do 50% one week and then they swap around. These were in the spring section, so these are brand new. They just came out not long ago. Or maybe summer section. I'm sorry, it is summer section because it was up front. I got three of them. They are normally $2.99. So with the 50% off, I got them for roughly $1.50 a piece. Now, you can't find these at the Dollar Tree, baby. Come on. Talk about it. Talk about it. You will not find these at the Dollar Tree. Even though the Dollar Tree is a dollar, these are $1.50. I would pay $1.50 any day because these are gorgeous. And they're not teeny tiny, but they're cute. They're just, they're cute. And by the way, if you guys are looking for those little milk bottles, and you're, like my Dollar Tree never has those milk bottles. They have them there in the glass section, and it, they were like, well, the 50% off, they would have been like three, around $2.50 to $3, because they were around, I want to say $4.99 on the regular, but when you get them on the 50, and they do that 50% off sale week by week, they swap it around, so if you don't get the sale this week, the next week, or the net, or the week after, you will get that sale on that item. I hope that makes sense, but most of us know how Hobby Lobby, how they do their sales, but yeah, I got these, okay, I'm trying to keep everything out of the way so I can actually make sure that I don't pass anything up, oh, these are some of my favorites, y'all, these were also 50% off, they're little milk cans, <laughs> stop the press, they're milk cans. In the South, we call them milk jugs. Um, these were $2.99. So, these were about roughly $1.50 a piece. And, guys, they're not tiny. They're, these are not tiny. If you found one of these at the Dollar Tree, you know you would snatch it up. So, right now, they're having their 50% off of these items, these summer items. So, go get you some of these, baby. 
I ended up getting four of them. I should have got more. But I'm gonna tell you what right now, hubby's already gonna kill me, so was it matter if I get more? So, I don't, uh, if you guys are crafters, you probably know who Tim Holtz is. Um, he has a lot of the scrapbooking type looking stuff. Um, it's hard for me to verbalize what I'm trying to get out. But he's got like a lot of scrapbooky. Um, he does a lot of stamp, scrapbook, uh, paper type crafting stuff. I hope that makes sense. But I got these. They are a set of six different sized frames is all they are. They're little frames. And do you see the detail around those frames? I'm trying to get where I can actually see myself what you're looking at. Yeah. It's got like little lacy details. And it's not hardwood, but it's not something that's going to just be crappy and break the next minute you get it either. It's, it's a good quality. And it was, I'm sorry. It was six forty nine, half off of that, so what three twenty five? And I any day, y'all, any day, because when I'm doing my crafts, y'all know that I like to, I go extra sometimes, and I just keep adding and adding and adding and adding. So who's to say I don't have a picture this size? And I'm like, hey, but what if I just stuck me a little old frame on the front of that, and that's me? That's what I do. And um, this is their wood pile stuff that I really like. This is just a simple frame also. It's a, probably a four by six. So if I had a picture that was a five by seven, I'm going to stick this on it. And it's going to be a little flame. And it's just, it's just cute, you know. And I came across these in the wood pile. These were $3.99. So I paid roughly two bucks for these. They are eight laser cut wood words. Eat your heart out, Dollar Tree, because Dollar Tree has been getting those little laser cut things that everybody's into. Not my Dollar Tree. Oh, no, no, no. They could not possibly do something that nice for us. But I did find these at the Hobby Lobby in Woodpile for, like I said, for two bucks. And it's got like, it says coffee blessed, hope, welcome, um, what does that say backwards, sather, gather, gather, it's backwards, um, and I can't read it, hello, one says hello, hello, so anyways, these are, that's a good buy for two bucks, and you can, I mean, they're tiny, and you can stick them on your little stuff, come on, y'all, that's cute, now, here's more wood pile stuff. Anybody that watches my crafts knows that I like to put a lot of words on stuff. I just like to do that. And I'm really strangely close to the camera. But I love you. And this says, create. And I paid. It was $1.50, so this was $0.75, cents, y'all. So, I wanted some big ones because this is going to go in my craft studio next week when I have it open. And these are going to go up on the walls. Even though these are kind of small, I saw them big before. And I want a big one to go up on my wall that says create. I saw that in somebody, you know, like a Pinterest craft room I was looking at. And I thought that was so cool because that's what you're doing in there is you're creating. And it says create when you walk in and people be like, whoa, create. I, know. I just thought that was cute. But these little ones, it's going to be like, create, 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 create when you walk in. Okay, here's some more of the Tim Holtz. This is called Stickabitties. Stickabilities. <laughs> Stickabilities. And this is the Tim Holtz stuff. And all this is is just a little border. That's kind of what I look at it as. It looks like burlap. And it's shaped like, it's got like, um, it, it, and it's like, you know, this long. <laughs> I don't know. It's like an 8 by 10. It's a little bit longer than an 8 by 10. And an 8 by 10 is about right there. So, I'm thinking it's maybe like 11 long. Let's just say, it may not even be a foot long, okay? Let's just say it's a foot long. It's about a foot long. It is a 12 inches. I was right. It is a foot long. So, anyway, 
it's um they're just like there's like little circles and it's all burlap and little flowers and you can use it as a border on something and it would be very very pretty and then i'm gonna be doing coastal soon so i got these out of the wood pile these were originally 80 cents a piece so i paid 40 cents of each for these cute they're little wood things and then I got this. I like, like I said, I like to embellish my stuff. You guys know I work with Totally Dazzled and I love all the little be dazzled, everything, everything. Remember my blessings box where we put our prayers at? Um, that, remember that had a bunch of be dazzles on it. So I love anything with be dazzles on it. And this is, you know, it looks like a little lace. It's just beautiful. That would be beautiful on any little picture and that's also 12 inches got it it was 12 inches okay and i think that's it oh no it's not it there's one more thing there's two more things this is one of my favorite things okay this is a shelf this is going in my craft room this shelf let me bring it back so you can actually see it okay it was $16.24, so that's 75% off. At the top, this has that cathedral, you know, those windows that look kind of like cathedral, and it's iron. So, and if you don't want to use one of the shelves, they both go up. So, you know what I'm saying? If you just want to use, let's say you've got a tall shelf or vase that you want to put on this bottom one, even though that doesn't look good. I mean, if you wanted to do it, it's yours and whatever you want to do. Don't let me judge. Um, but, I mean, this is what it looks like. And I think this is so incredibly cute, y'all. Let me stand where you can maybe see a little bit better. Can you see it now? See, I mean, isn't that, that was $16. And I, th I thought that was a good deal. That was one of my 75% off items. And... Let me put that down where it doesn't drop. But I have like, oops, I turned my light off. Hold on one second. Wow. Sorry, guys, my camera had, the light had went off. Um, and I've got two more things to show you, so I'll be quick. And I, of course, I just got my original crafting paper that I always get. I got this kind. I got this one. And then I got this blue because I've really been into that blue color that people are using a lot lately. I think that's really pretty that was its normal price which is for the smaller ones it's 59 cents the bigger one's 69 cents um i got this picture it says pamper yourself and it's 374 this was part of the 75 percent off deal and if i'm having to guess okay i don't have to guess because it says on the back it's an 11 by 12 so it's an 11 by 12 and for 374 I didn't buy it for this picture which this is wood by the way I did not buy it for this picture I'm going to redo it with something so I mean if you're a crafter and even if you want buy something like this you're still doing good I've got one more item and then I promise I'm going <laughs> I know y'all are probably like shut up um this is a 14 by 10 and it says blessed, which I wouldn't mind using it the way that it is. But I paid $4.49 for it, 75% off. And it says blessed, and the blessed is raised like, so here's my thought. This is wood also. I'm thinking I'm going to pull the blessed off there, which I can use the blessed on a different project. I can use the front, or I can flip it over take the uh, part off the, the, the wall hanger, the little hanger, flip it around to the back and use this part, paint this and create a border. So guys, I thank y'all for joining me. I hope everyone has had a blessed week and I will see y'all soon. Hopefully I'll come up with some more hauls soon because I'm kind of liking it now that I'm doing them. But my husband's like, but I'm like, so anyways, I love you guys. I'll see y'all soon. Bye. Sabby's ready to surf. Sabby. And don't worry, guys. This is totally safe. Sabby has done this since he was a baby. So don't nobody come after me and say, oh my gosh, you're going to kill that dog. 
plus he can swim believe it or not he's an avid swimmer and you guys will see very soon this dog we put a life jacket on him and he rides jet skis he rides motorcycles four wheelers this dog has rode anything with the motor and he's just a bad boy he's done this since he was a puppy so don't worry he is advanced and well trained look at those back muscles on that monster he is just ferocious and he knows it he is one bad boy he says i ain't scared of nothing now the water is cold i do not understand why my daughter is swimming but it's around 86 degrees here in tennessee today it's nice outside but the water is still cool there he is he's swimming he says see i'm a bad boy i'm a bad boy look at it hey sabby sabby are you riding this scuff board are you riding the scuff board? He says yes. See, he has no fear. He is so, he's so tough. Wow. Look at the muscles on that monster. He is so cool.